And that is extremely important that you learn how to parallel park. Uh, you want to line your car up, you want to reverse it back at a 45 angle, and you want to turn that wheel hand over hand to the right. The rear would go in to the right. So you have to be safe. You've got to take your time. More on that. Um, let's talk about proper signaling. 100 feet a half a block. Beginner drivers tend to turn on the blinker too early, right? If you turn it on too early, you're going to confuse other drivers. What is this driver doing? Or you turn it on too late, thereby the other driver is caught off guard. So proper timing is important. You want to be patient. You want to take your time. Uh, let's talk about lane changing. You want to signal. You want to check your mirrors. It's mirror, turn signal, blind spot, right? You want to really be patient and, and get better every day. You want to uh, turn your head. Head checks are really important. If you're making a lane change to the left, you got to look over to the left. If you're making a lane change to the right, it's mirror, turn signal, and you look. So have that head movement. Beginning drivers tend to look over the wrong shoulder. They tend to forget their left and right. So that's why I'm here as a certified instructor to help you, to encourage you, to help you get better. You want to maintain proper speed. Beginning drivers tend to go really slow and lose some momentum or they tend to go too fast. So you always want to do that consistent work. Be patient if you're not sure. Seek the guidance of your instructor. Um, let's talk about safe driving behaviors. You want to make sure you put on your seatbelt. In the excitement of giving it to the car, you have to put on your seatbelt. If you don't put on your seatbelt, that could be an automatic failure. So we want to remind you to do that. Next, you want to maintain good speed at all times. You're going to want to go over speed. You're going to want to go under speed. You want to be consistent with your speed. And if you're consistent with your speed, you're going to make more lights. You won't have to run lights and you'll be able to understand the flow of the traffic. You wanna identify and respond to proper traffic signals, proper uh, signaling ahead, and this all takes patience. You always wanna be aware, and you have to go at the speed limit.